around 6.50 here and today we are at Chester Cathedral where today, well, and for about a month or two, they are playing host for this. So basically a massive model railway layout here at the cathedral is here. Well, and for one or two months, um, Pete Waterman and Hornby Magazine and all that lot, they are here um, making the railway work, you know, showing it off to the, to the general public. There's a BMU over there. Might be able to just see the DMU. There. Anyway, um, the sad thing is for all steam fans here that there is no steamers apart from an A4 called Seagull and they have a Merchant Navy. So if you like Southerners and LNER, come here. And uh, yeah, it's very long, it's about 64 foot long apparently. Um, should be another train due soon, so we're going to just wait for the next train. But I thought, whilst we're waiting, have a look at this. The houses are absolutely incredible. We've got, we've got a load of locations on the West Coast main line and jumbled them up into one big layout. So we've got Shrugba Tunnel, we've got Road Junction, and here we have a class 158 crossing the viaducts. And a class 86, 28, well, an 87 and an 86. With a load of blue circle cement tankers. And then we have the 158 here. <laughs> yeah, quite a variety. And we can go around the side to a better place to see the train which is here and if I can just zoom in you might be able to see the Merchant Navy it's just there so she's there and hopefully she might be coming out soon but we'll have to see because they kind of just set them just come in and out should be one due in a minute so they, they're very, very set intervals, but mostly nearly all the time. So yeah, and here comes one in a moment. Um, here it is, class 86. A very long line of coaches. So I'm going to leave you with the final sweep of the main layout and then maybe another train and then we're going to wrap it up. It's going to be a short video but it might be incorporated in a Chester vlog. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to do a final sweep here of the layout. Unfortunately, some of the uh, people who um, help run this layout informed me that they have little intruders which uh, produce a lot of poo. Pigeons. And here comes a class 47 with some royal coaches. There she goes. And I'll see you maybe at the vlog on the next video. Goodbye.
Chester Amphitheatre. Now I know it's a transportation orientated channel, so there's an E400 EV. Um, but yeah, this is the um, original Roman amphitheatre where they would have put on shows and um, done a lot of entertainment and sometimes animal murdering and stuff like that, you know. <coughs> but just going to say all this. It's really, really strange place, but. So if you like transport then we're going to take a trip down to the River Dee in a little bit and uh, have a look at the boats. So yeah, off we go. We are on the one of the Chester River boats. It's very good. It's not very expensive either. Engines. for long because they're playing copyrighted music I'm afraid so I had to put some music over this. Just going along the river D it goes for three miles. It's very nice. I really recommend it. It's 11 quid well, for, for us. Yeah. So being on the boat we had a really interesting tour. And um, yeah, now we're now we're um, there's the bus and Alexander Dan is the ALX 100. So if you're interested in buses, that's what it is. And we've got the Jack in the boat. Uh, uh, we've got a, a very very friendly swan as well. So I'll say hello to that. Next next sailing four o'clock. We've already been on it, so. I don't think we'll come on again. Oh no, I mean in the future we will. Very nice. Yeah, that's that's another craft I want to go on the jetty. It's a bit smaller than the other one. Yeah, the ducks. I think I've got food, I think. And then there's a big swan over there. Just up there. This is a big big bridge in Very big. It doesn't actually look like a pedestrian bridge, it looks like a road bridge to me, but it's actually a pedestrian bridge. But yeah. Um Chester, which is still existing. I went here years ago. Here's a little POV of a ride. line but it's still a nice little one.
So today we're, we're back at Chester Station. Um, we're here, yes, and we're going to get a train back. And also my camera battery is dying, so I better reserve the power. Anyway, <coughs> yeah, I hope to, you know, just do the normal. Also, there's the Jill Sands MT Chester. If the camera will focus, they're gorgeous. Yeah, that's really nice. 